Hey guys, what's up? And welcome back to my channel. Um, if you are not new here, and if you are new here, um, welcome to my channel. And um, I know it has been a couple of weeks at the most since I had made a video. Um, I've just been busy and whatnot, and just had a lot going on and all that. <clears throat> but um, I'm just wanted to do in complete a completion video on the uh a current diamond painting that I was working on that I had unboxed for you all that is from Diamond Art Club. Um I ran into a few issues with this one and it was only on my end, not their end. But um I'll explain that to you all here in a minute when I show you all the diamond painting. <clears throat> I know Valentine's Day was yesterday. Um, happy Valentine's Day, everyone. I hope y'all had a good day. I had to work, even though my fiancé was off work. He does part-time now at our job, so he is off every Tuesday now, along with our Wednesday and Thursday. But I still have to work Wednesday, so. But we had a really good Valentine's Day, and we're actually going to town today, so... We get paid, we're going to get some groceries and all that good stuff. But, um, I hope y'all are doing good. And, um, I'm just going to kind of, like, slightly explain to you what I was talking about on this diamond painting. I kind of mixed a couple of colored drills by accident. And, um... Hopefully you all won't notice, but you all will, you all might be able to notice it on the diamond painting. I don't know. But I was trying to figure out what colors would look best with which ones whenever I had finished my diamond painting. So yeah. But the diamond painting didn't take me long at all to get done. It's just, it's been done for about a week. And I've just been cro procrastinating on making a video and all that. So I do apologize. But I have it done and I'll be doing a unboxing video I kind of want to do one today, but I might have to wait until a few days from now or maybe next week. And it's going to be from the same company, Diamond Art Club, and it's going to be a picture of a cat again. But um, I'll give all the details whenever I do the video for you all. But if y'all um, ended up liking this video or if it was um, informative or helpful by any chance, don't forget to hit that like button and don't forget to comment down below. And also... Um, Hit that subscribe button, you all. Help my channel out. And also, don't forget to share my videos with all your friends and family. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you all what the completed look is for this diamond painting. Oh, Lord. Alright, this is what this looks like. And honestly, in my opinion, it looks really, really adorable. It looks good. It looks great. <clears throat> Um, I don't know if you all can tell, but I'm pretty sure that you all can tell that in some spots I uh, probably don't have the colors where it should be, but I still think it looks okay. I don't, I don't think on some spots you can tell, but like I said, I accidentally mixed a few things of drills into different containers, and I think uh, a few of them were the four number digit ones down here ah if I can like these right here the um yeah the four number uh color code is the ones that I mixed up so I was trying to figure out a way to make the picture not look like a five year old basically put it together <clears throat> So yeah, it would probably look a little bit slightly different with a different color if I hadn't mixed the colors together, but I don't think it looks too, too bad. Um, you probably do notice that there's purple in these uh, chunks of chocolate chips in the cookies because when the I was kind of looking in the dark on the side to find my container that I thought looked like a dark colored brown which it did look like a dark colored brown at first but then whenever I got done completing it 
Um, it was purple. So I have purple slash dark brown colored chocolate chips in my cookie. It'd be okay though. But yeah. Other than that, I think it turned out okay-ish. Also, this part right here, I think I kind of maybe could have done a different color on that one. Because I don't think that's supposed to be there. But I'm really excited about it because it did have AB drills. And yeah, I know in my video I kind of mentioned that it, I didn't think it would have it. But it clearly says it on the freaking box. It even says it on the very bottom of this right here. AB drills. You would think that I would learn how to read and be like, y'all, it says this has AB drills in it. But yeah, it even says it on the box. I was just more excited about opening it up and looking at the freaking picture. But yeah, it has AB drills in it, so you all can roast me later about this. But. But if y'all are wondering, I can leave a link down below for you all. Um, like I said in my last video of me unboxing this, um, Seth bought this off of Amazon from Diamond Art Club since they now sell their canvases on that website. So you all can go to Amazon and type in Diamond Art Club and they should have some canvases for you all to look at and decide whether you want to purchase them or not. But, um... This one had 22 symbols to it, and this is a partial, I don't know if y'all can tell. So basically it was just the cookies, the kitten, and the cup of milk that you all really need to do. And like I had mentioned in my last video, this would honestly be kind of perfect for a beginner because you don't have to do the full um, square, it's just the partial, so you only have to worry about doing the kitten and then the cookie jar and the milk. Even though it is kind of expensive, but not too, too bad. <clears throat> but I still think it would be almost like a perfect choice. <clears throat> You'd also be supporting Diamond Art Club for the first time, so. But yeah, this is a 13 by 13 inches. It one off four sides. Even though the place where you're putting your diamond drills aren't, but... I'm going to go ahead and give you all a close-up of what the beads look like. But yes, um, Diamond Art Club, they do have very uh, amazing drill beads, diamond drill quality. But yeah, you all can tell the AB drills right there. And oh, this little kit's in is so precious. Into eyeballs. Wish my camera would focus. I apologize if my camera won't focus. I'm using my phone. Have been using my phone since the very beginning of my video or my channel, actually. But yeah. I wish my focused a little bit. I know my drills are not exactly straight. I try to straighten them out every once in a blue moon when I put them on there, but not all the time. But yes, if y'all are wondering, this is the completion of it by Diamond Art Club. So, And this is by Marilyn. Like I said, don't, don't expect me to pronounce the last name of this. But yeah. <clears throat> Um, I didn't really have any problems. I mean, Diamond Art Club, everyone loves Diamond Art Club, so. They're just really expensive. But they do come with a lot of good, nice tools to use for your diamond painting. And they do come with everything you need to do your diamond painting with. They just come with, like, the extra stuff. So. But. <clears throat> uh. I believe that is it for this video. Like I said, if you all found this video helpful or informative by any chance, don't forget to hit that like button and comment down below. And also, don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel.
and also share my video with your friends and family for everyone else that likes diamond paintings or diamond art club diamond paintings <clears throat> and um, I will see you all next time I'm gonna try and do another video as soon as I can so it might be a bit but just bear with me and until then I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, everyone.